Hello and welcome to Fury Gaming. I'm Wolfgar, obviously. Uh, today I'm going to be playing Fractured Space. Now I know nothing about this game. It's just come out on. Well, it's uh, been released for the weekend uh, on Steam. Now this game also ha um, it is alpha version at the moment. Um, but the interesting thing of what's made us get it is if you install it now uh, by Monday. Uh, this game will allow you to have um, full access. Basically, you won't, won't have to buy it later. Once you've installed it, it's permanent. You get to keep it. Um, so, gonna give it a try. Now, as I said, don't know anything about it. Uh, just quickly read this. Um, <clears throat> so, we're going to launch Proving Grounds. I know nothing about what it is. So, let's have a look. At let's see. Platinum is currency. Um, precious premium ships, yep, yep. Okay, um... Welcome. This is basic the basic training. command training program. You are currently in jump space, awaiting arrival at the proving grounds. The proving grounds are where you can familiarize yourself with vessels <coughs> and train for combat. Yay, combat! You will be jumping to the proving grounds shortly. Yes, please. Use your mouse to look around. The mouse Use alters it. your view. It allows you to aim at targets. Well, let me move then. Before we continue, it is worth becoming familiar with your ship's interface. Hold the O key. Oh. Oh, okay. Good. This guide is available at all times. So resources, upgrade levels, <coughs> team level. Oh, I can move right now. The K key displays the default layout of your controls. It can be viewed whenever required. Oh, the K key. Try it now. So, well done. Remember, fire, okay. secondary, sniper mode. I select like it already. And select your destination with the left mouse button to jump to Alpha uh, Sector sorry. Proving Grounds. Um, that one? Okay, we're doing something. <laughs> oh, good God. This is where we test the latest weapon systems. And new vessels. Okay. The indicated structure is your forward station. It offers automatic repairs and upgrades, as well as jump access to the team's base. Time to familiarize yourself with the controls of your vessel. Start by using the W, A, S, and D keys to control forwards, backwards, and rotational movements. Oh, it's slow moving, you must hold down the relevant key to continue moving. No, no shit. <laughs> Head to the flashing mining station. Forward ho! I got this urge to shoot it. Can I shoot it? I'm here. The capture sphere of a mining station captures it to give your team resources. Capture right. it now. Right, I'm fully inside. Oh, well capture is there. You have captured the mining station. <clears throat> now go capture the next one. Test your weapon systems against the dummy targets on the way. Press the T key to select your target. Oh, that would help. Use the Q and oh, oh, E oh. Oh. to strafe left and right. Ah, that was what I was looking for. Need to dodge these. Oh, oh, and right click. There you go. All right, okay. Snipe mode. One click requires four rounds. Okay. Right. I'm gonna be fully in. Okay. This is 
That's why it's important for your team to be in control of the mine. Resources mining. Uh, use, yeah, okay. Where do I upgrade? On the map, you will notice that the mines under our control are clearly indicated by color. Ah, yes. In the bottom right, you can see that. Now capture the final mine. You can see it flashing now. Targeting your enemy. Any weapon systems you can use will highlight on your reticule as you approach. And down. Sorry about that. Oh, right, so shift shift brings up the mini map. Okay. Good. Remember, the more mines we control, the more resources we get, and the faster we can upgrade. Yeah, upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Well done. Gain resources, yep, we know that much. Okay. Launch, what is Gamma? Okay, so we got part two. Let's see. Bait and switch, taking an enemy forward station while enemies defend their home base. Sucker punch, flank instead of direct attack. Defense is a good offense. Ooh. Welcome. What's this? this is the Gamma facility and base control training program. Here you will learn about essential elements of base capture and control. Okay. Jump to the Alpha Lane and start to capture the mines to gather resources before the Gamma Countdown reaches zero. Um, was it K? No, it wasn't K. 
L. Hold the shift key and select your destination with the left mouse button to jump to Alpha Sector Proving Grounds. That's the one. <laughs> shift. Shift key. Rings of the map. Okay. Let's start by capturing the closest yeah. line that is now flashing. That's what I was thinking. The Press and T. Are a helpful reminder of your interface and controls. Remember, OK. <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. But a bunch. Oh, so it's a timer. Good. It was seven minutes. Remember, the more minds we control, the more resources we get, and the faster we can upgrade. Yep. Now capture the middle mining station. I'm on it. I see their base. Warning. Enemy contact. Use your mouse to aim your primary weapon. And use the T key to target the enemy vessel. Use the right mouse button to fire your ship's secondary weapon. Oh, I like I like those Merlin missiles. Well done. Good shooting. Too many blows to the head. Return to an allied forward station <clears throat> to upgrade your ship. Now, I'm capturing first. I want to Rank. capture. Turn back. We are not ready to continue the assault yet. Check Five. your objectives. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I like this. I like this. Gamma sector periodically comes online. It is currently inactive. That's not very good. Hold the shift key and select your destination with the left mouse button. Oh, oh we're moving now. We're moving. I don't know what's going on. That's my base over there. Forward hold. And there we go. So we we'll automatically get upgrades upon returning, I believe. Do we have to be well done. You have now upgraded your ship. The higher your upgrade level, the better your ship's performance. Okay. That's nice. What did you actually get? Okay. Me? We will speed up the gamma recharge time for training purposes. Okay. Prepare to capture gamma station when it becomes active. You are unlikely to be the only one interested in its capture. So I wanna go going gamma? Alright, we're going gamma. You must use your jump drive to get to Gamma. Initiate the jump sequence. I've done that. I'm at Gamma. Do I want to be at one of the outside ports? Or is... <coughs> Let's go in Gamma. We're going to have a small bubble around it. Yep, yeah, like that. Facility in Gamma is now active. Capture it to get a buff for your whole team. Uh oh, it appears we have company. Enemy sighted. Use your missiles now.
resources are going up. So I might. Oh, I'm definitely going to want resources. Okay, so we got. What does point defense do? Oh, so I, could, I can turn it on and off. Okay. Interesting. So let's see. Oh, your health. Your energy. Energy's there. Health. Gamma facility has now been captured. Nicely done. Now your whole team benefits from the gamma buff. Decreasing cooldown times and increasing damage output. Bad news. Check your minimap. There's an enemy capturing your forward station. Hold the shift key and select your destination. With the Going in, boys. Button. We're gonna get us killed. Jumping. Capture their base and finish them. Although you are now in training, in live combat, teamwork is essential. When in battle and your allies have captured a forward station, be prepared to jump into the enemy home sector at short notice. Deflect incoming missiles at point defense. Okay. Right, we are getting in there. Now, I want it. <coughs> Is it like most games? You are currently taking damage from the so enemy home base. In live combat, this damage will be far greater. 